In this video, we will analyze a simple bridge with point loads. So first, open the SAP 2000 program. The first thing you should do is change the units at the right hand bottom corner of the screen to KIP foot. Now go to File and click on New Model. In the window that appears, keep the X direction number of grid spaces the same and change the Y direction to 1 and Z direction to 2. Under Grid Spacing, change X to 20, Y to 24 and Z to 15 and then click OK. Click on the window on the left hand side and then click the X, Z box above it. Now click on the right hand window and do the same thing. Now select the draw frame element tool and start drawing on the right hand side window. Here I'm drawing a, si a simple bird structure. Make sure you draw in all the frames for a thorough analysis of the bridge. Now once that's done, select the leftmost point on the right hand window and then go to the Assigns tab and select restraints and under fast restraints select the pin restraint now follow the same procedure for the right hand side but instead of a pin we'll be using a roller restraint now select all the frames of the bridge And once you're done selecting all the frames, go to the Assign tab and under Frame, select Releases. Now, select both the Start button and Start and the End boxes for Moment 2-2 and Moment 3-3. Now go to the Define tab and under Static Load Cases, let's rename it to a DL for dead load and assign self weight multiplier to zero click change load and then hit OK select the second point from the bottom of the bridge select assign and joined static loads go to forces select global z force and change it to negative 24 and hit ok now do the same for the next two points on the bridge Once that's done, select the Analyze tab on top, select Set Options, click Plane Frame and select OK. Now go into the Analyze tab again and then hit Run this time. It will ask you to save the file and once you have saved it, the system will run the analysis and you should get a message saying Analysis Complete. Want to see the message? Click OK. 
the right hand window will show you a deformed shape now you can go into the display tab and under show element forces slash stresses select frames and deselect fill diagram and select show values on diagram and it will show you all the reactions on your frame due to the point loads you have added thank you